I would normally park right over in this pot lot every day. And then I come here and the thing's bagged with no information about anything and how am I supposed to resolve this issue at all? Like, what am I supposed to do? Just park here and hope I don't get a fine? I, I have no idea. I don't know what I would do, drive around town. Nurses at Kelowna General Hospital reached out to Castanet directly, expressing their frustration with on-site parking, saying it has doubled. KGH parking manager Andrew Pattison said this isn't the case, but instead they are just enforcing a protocol on lots that are not open to staff. The metered parking has always been intended for uh, patients and visitors to the hospital, not necessarily for staff. And so nothing's changed for the patients or visitors. It's just we've uh, wanted to add some control uh, to ensure that the, the parking is available for the public when they're trying to come to KGH. Some staff are using the, the public parking passes. Uh, we're taking away their ability to do that by sort of having this uh, control where people just call the parking office. One nurse said staff and visitors with family that need longer parking are not allowed to purchase monthly passes, stating KGH is not looking after their staff or patients. Currently, year passes are available to staff for $392.64 a year, but there is at least a three-year wait list to even get one. An after-hour pass can be purchased for $209.64. So if it's a staff member that calls in trying to access in access one of those monthly passes, they would be reminded that uh, they're not available for staff. One nurse said parking on site cost her $120 a month. Outside of KGH, there is a, uh, a lot, uh, a few blocks away, uh, Burnett Avenue that uh, we own and that is available for staff at KGH. We encourage them to go over there. The cost is a dollar a day for that one. We're just trying to balance their availability with demand and ensuring that uh, you know, staff have access to their passes and uh, we're, we're keeping spaces available for, for patients in public coming to the facilities as well. A nurse walking out of the hospital today told me that she used to purchase a pass monthly and this change came just last week and she's not sure what she's going to do come November. Now, if you have an opinion about this topic, you can contact us at letters at castanet.net. For Castanet News, I'm Alana Kelly in Kelowna. Read letters to the editor in our letters section under the opinion button in the yellow masthead. Email your letters to letters at castanet.net. <laughs>